thank you for being here because you're in the middle of a world tour, so uh, I appreciate you stopping by. Uh, yeah, I love it. Are you kidding me? Oh this is God. the. Does, does <laughs> anyone? Thank you. Okay, so so let me let me kiss let me kiss your butt real quick. Uh oh. Okay, so it's like uh, Whoopi is like my everything, right? And, and one thing I loved about Whoopi was her one-man show, and it was just like, I watched that, and I was just like, oh my God, what is this? And then when she got the EGOT, I was like, what? And then you got the EGOT, I'm like, what? And then, ah, and then Viola got the EGOT. And then, and then Viola got yes! the EGOT. And I'm like, talented black women get EGOT. Oh my God. Thank you. What great company to be in. Yes, like, in an, like it's an elite class. And like, I don't think people really understand how hard it is to get. It's like it's been over 100 and what, 20 years in Hollywood? And <laughs> it's you three? <laughs> like, that's crazy. We like, be working. Crazy. Thank All you. All right, for so that. I just wanted to say that. I, I, it's, it's, it's such an amazing thing. So I'm inspired by you. So thank you so I, yeah. much. Thank you. That means everything yeah. coming from you. Now, you've been in the game a long time. How long ago, how old were you when you started doing comedy? 1989, right out of high school. Out of high school? Right out of high school. Oh I saw God. Eddie Murphy and I, I just fell in love. Like, I mean, I loved Richard Pryor, but when, you, when I physically saw Eddie Murphy on uh, HBO, that's when I was like, I want to be him. I, I remember asking my mom for the red leather outfit. I was like, I need a red <laughs> leather outfit. And she was like, Joseph, no, you can't wear leather. <laughs> and, uh, and then I ended up, that, that's Raw, by the way, what you just posted, and I went to Raw. Uh -huh. I went to Raw when I was 15 years old. 15? I was 15. And back in the, back in the day, they didn't have, like, Ticketmaster.com. Uh, you had to literally, like, phone, you know what I mean? You and then you give a credit card number, and then the person that was on the other line had to, like, determine whether or not that's really your card. So I would just use my mom's voice. Back, this is, like, 85, I was 86. gonna ask, how did you do that at 15? I was just like, I really want two tickets to the Eddie Murphy comedy <laughs> show. Where would you like your seats? Oh, the best possible, <laughs> if you don't mind. And literally, that's how I got my tickets. I went after school and picked up my tickets, and uh, I was 15 rows from the stage, and we sat at the, it was the Seattle Coliseum when I saw him at 15. And then, and then fast forward, I, it was so crazy, because I remember sitting there looking up at the ceiling and just seeing it packed, and I was like, I can't believe this many people are here to see that. And then, and then fast forward to like two years ago when I sold out the same arena, the same arena. that I went to, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it was insane. Oh my God. Congratulations insane. on thank that. You, it's thank so you. many things. Oh, well, tell us, what was it like when you told your mom you wanted to be a comedian? Oh, she, she, she cried. She cried. She cried? Yeah, because you know, she's, she came from the Philippines. There she is. <laughs> she, came, uh, she came from the Philippines, and it's like, you know, come here and you, you want the best for their kids. Yes. And it's like, you know, you, you don't know what struggle is, Joseph. <laughs> and, then, uh, and then I'm like, well, I want to be a comedian. She's like, a clown? You want to be a clown? <laughs> <laughs> No one wants a clown, Joseph. <laughs> and she wanted me to go to college. And I'm like, Mom, come on, I barely passed high school. How am I going to go to college? And, yes. uh, and she just was not getting it until I uh, bought her house. And then she's like, yes. I was going to say, what's she like, think yes. now? Yes. How are you doing, Mom? Now she's like introducing me. This is my favorite clown. <laughs> this is my favorite clown. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> and and grow up, when you were growing up, you were a dancer? Well, I mean, I think it, it, just anything entertainment. When you're broke, it's like, <laughs> you know what I mean? When you're broke, there's like, there's no cable television. There's no, <laughs> there's no, uh, there's, you were the entertainment. <laughs> so it was like my sister sang and I danced. And then she, we would go to the mall and my mom would make me dance in front of like, uh, Mrs. Fields cookies and uh, yeah, I swear it's so embarrassing <laughs> to even talk about, but it's like, it's just like my mom would gather the circle. Everyone, look, my son can do the Michael Jackson. <laughs> do you have any rituals before you go out on your tour? Uh, I pee. I have to pee. <laughs> I have to pee. I swear, I was traumatized in Cincinnati at a comedy club. I had a few drinks in the green room, and next thing you know, they're like, "Ladies and gentlemen, Joe Coy." And I was like, "Wait, I haven't peed yet." And I went on stage. <laughs> I did like almost like two hours. And, uh, and, and there was some, like, dribbles that came out. And, bro, what am I supposed to do? I'm a performer. And, and, and little dribbles came out. And, and finally, at the end of my two hours, I was just like, you guys, I've been holding this piece since I got on stage. Yes. I need to leave. And I ran. And, uh, and I've been traumatized by that so much. <laughs> that, like, I mean, look at these shows. It's like, I can't go out there with pee. Like, I had to. <laughs> I have to be on E. I have to be, I have to be empty. 
I peed, peed on myself in Cincinnati, show. yes. Oh my God. I know you do too. There's oh no God. way. It's it's frightening to be on stage yes. and, and have to. Because you can't concentrate. You can't leave. It's yes. not like the audience. You guys can get up and go. We can't right. go anywhere. Imagine if we could. Hold on, I'll be right back. All right. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, right? Nah, the show must go mm -hmm. on, right? If you like this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the Jennifer Hudson Show YouTube channel. Check your local listings or visit JenniferHudsonShow.com to see when you can watch four episodes in your area. And don't forget to sign up for the newsletter.